Welcome to the tutorial on how to publish your game from the core editor. Publishing your core project opens it to the world or people you choose for playing, testing, and feedback. In this video, you will discover how to publish your game publicly so you can build community familiarity with your game and brand. We'll also cover how to publish your game privately if you're still creating and prototyping, allowing teammates and friends you choose to have access to your game for playtesting and feedback. All right, let's publish your game. To begin, open your project in the core editor. Click the publish game icon in the top right corner of the editor. Alternatively, you can publish by selecting file in the menu bar and selecting publish game. You will see the publish settings appear in a new window. Good game information is essential to helping players discover your game and understand what it is that they're going to play. If you haven't already, give your game a compelling name that you feel represents it best. Write a description that entices people to play and sets realistic expectations for the experience you've created. Tags help link your game to specific keywords and phrases when people search for games and content. Add all relevant tags. For example, if I were uploading a battle royale first-person shooter themed around space travel, I would add the tags action, battle royale, sci-fi, and multiplayer to start. Next, take a screenshot for your game. Set up your virtual camera to snap a shot in the editor with the camera button. Load a custom image from your computer by selecting the folder button. You can combine your screenshot with your photo editing skills to upload a custom image that really speaks to your game. Lastly, under Max Players, you can change the number of players max per server instance which is how many people can join your game. For example, if I were making a single player game, I would set this number to one. However, because this game is a multiplayer battle royale, I'm going to increase it to 16. And now you're set. Click publish in the bottom right corner. Success! If you've seen the success window, your game is now live. If published publicly, your game will be playable by anyone in the world. Promote your game on social media and send it to your friends. You can even click visit game page to go right to your game and see it in the wild for yourself. If published privately, you can send the link out to teammates or specific individuals to play test your game prototype. You don't have to worry about your game appearing in the games page or in search results. You can decide if your project is ready to be published publicly with Core's publishing checklist available online on the Core documentation site. If you feel you're ready to publish your game publicly, make sure you consider the following. Will players understand how to play and what the goals are? Does the game have an ending or discernible finish? And will players have a reason to play again? Does everything work, look, and sound the way you expect? Have you tested the game in multiplayer preview mode? Do the description and screenshots help players find the game and understand what it is? The goal of this checklist is to outline the essentials that you should check before you publish, then give you areas to continually check as you revise and republish your game in the future. Not everything in this list will apply to all possible core creations, and there will be more to consider based on the unique aspects of your design. For a more comprehensive checklist, as well as tutorials and guides, visit Core's documentation site. It's important to note, if you've already published and you're ready to update the published version of your game, you will need to republish using the review and update button. This concludes our tutorial on publishing your game in Core. Please view more of our videos and tutorials and tune into our Core live streams to interact with other creators, engineers, developers, and artists in the community. Details are in the description below. Make sure to drop us a line in the comments and don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Thanks for watching and creating in Core.